I play uh, Danny, who is the friend of Chris Walken. I think he had an, another name in the movie, when under a name is. And uh, we we just uh, show up to uh, keep uh, Robert De Niro company, Grandpa company, and uh, hijinks ensue. I, I too love uh, working with this whole uh, group of wonderful actors, but it was, for me, it was great watching their process because each process is different, you know, watching Christopher Walken uh, uh, choose the take he was going to actually use <laughs> because he would work up to it until that one take that's like stands out from all the rest. Uh, it was fun watching that process and De Niro was just so steady I and mean, it was like, you know, it was like playing with grandpa for a little kid. I liked working with the kids too, because uh, not only was it great to work with them, it knocked out uh, 50 hours of court mandated community service. <laughs> you know, it was a win-win for both sides. I think comedy should always be played in front of a big group because there's nothing more communal than to hear these giant laughs together, you know, that you might not even laugh at when you're uh, uh, at home by yourself or with a few people. You, you uh, acknowledge the, the comedy aspect of it, but to have that laugh out loud uh, reaction to it when the whole theater full of people, it's, it's, a, it's a thrill. I think the, 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 the real value of family togetherness will be reaffirmed in this film. And, uh, you know, kind of we need all the Valentines we can get at, at this point, you know, because we're being very chaotically split apart. And we need to very organized uh, effort to come together. Hopefully not the popcorn. <laughs>